as well as that have. I'll have stay one priority. One Come on. Yeah, I've got a stolen vehicle coming towards me. I have about one minute left. Uh, it's going to be southbound on the Los Santos Freeway. Can I get authority for a preemptive stinger uh, before yeah, it arrives? Over. Thank you very much. Can I get some channel more units? Over. Yeah, take up one. User joined your channel. Only three, two, two. Yeah, I've got him stopped at the hospital. Which hospital is that? Uh, Strawberry yeah, Avenue, by the motorway. Yep. I'm gonna now. Hello, you're under arrest on suspicion of theft of a motor vehicle. You do not have to say anything in a Mahami defense. If you do, don't mention when questions are actually learning. Cool. Anything you do say, maybe give an evidence. You understand? Get your fucking hands off me. I've done fucking Good. nothing. We're just going to place you in the back of the car for now. I just, uh, we're going to be doing some inquiries. Alright, stop swearing at me. User joined your channel. That was bloody brilliant, Stinger. <laughs> User left your channel. <laughs> well, it's the position it's in. It's like a job. Oh, dear. Right, we'll get a few details off the lady. Hello, lady, what's your name? Fuck off. Right, okay. Are you not going to tell me your name? I ain't fucking telling you, Shine, done nothing wrong. Okay, well, I just told you what you are uh, 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 under arrest yeah, for. Yeah, stolen car, blah, 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 whatever, it's not even stolen. Who's ca whose car is it then? I don't know. Okay, well, that's fine. My well, mate gave it to me, he said drive it down to somewhere, and then that was it. Right. I was driving it for him, he didn't tell me it was bloody stolen. Why would it be stolen? He got the keys for it. Right, okay. So what's your name? What's your name? If you, Why are I telling you my if name? You what do you want my name for? You're you going to let me go, if, I've done nothing. If you're innocent, then well, you need to tell me your name in the section 165 of the road traffic act. You've been driving That's a vehicle on the road. This. Chantel. Chantel, okay. And what's your last name, yeah. Chantel? Brown. Brown. You best let me go after this, I'm giving you my name. Like this, yeah? Did I spell that correctly on my device? Uh, it's got two L's in, with an E as well. Chantel Brown, like that. That's it, yeah. That's the one, okay. Oh, what's your date of birth? 28th of February 1991. Okay. Right, and uh, where are you going to today? Going to drop a car off. Okay, are you aware of your bail condition? I got cancelled. I got cancelled. You're currently further yeah. under arrest on suspicion of breaching your bail conditions. Okay, so the same caution applies. You know, I'd say thinking about my defence. We do the major questions. So actually, actually, I didn't anything you do say. Maybe given evidence. Okay. The reason for this is that you're not meant to be in the area of Westminster unless you've got a pre-arranged appointment. See a solicitor or no, to attend court. No, my solicitor told me that was cancelled. Well, it's not, because it's like still in my system, mate. Oh, fuck's sake. Right. My colleague's just going to oh, search the vehicle. Shit. I'm going to search yourself. So you just like to step out the vehicle for a moment? Good lady. Right, stand over there. We're going to search you. Have you got anything you shouldn't have? Nah. Give you a search. So what have you got in the car, Nemeth? Yeah, just um, found some somewhere. Cannabis. Cannabis. Yes. Okay. Right, at the moment, you're further under arrest on suspicion of possession of a Class B controlled substance, namely cannabis. You are saying anything, ma'am, defence, you do not mention questions, so I should actually learn in court, anything you do so, maybe give an evidence, okay? Mate, there's nothing even in there. Right, okay. You can't do me for having that little bit in there. Well, yes, I can, and you've got more in the car. There's nothing in the car, rubbish. You fucking put it in there. I didn't put it in Chantel, there. Chantel, there's, um, Klaus Bean in the car. So it doesn't matter if there's nothing on you in person, it's still in the vehicle. Well, you fucking put it there. I didn't put it there. I've got, I've got a body cam on, so we, we can look at that when we get back to the station. Whatever, yeah. Right, before we put you back in the car, I'm going to be doing a drugs test on you. So make sure you haven't got any drugs in your system. So there's going to be a preliminary drugs test at the uh, roadside. Do you agree? To remain with a specimen of saliva. Why should I? 
Well, I, uh, I, I, I must. I why why should you? Oh, okay, I must caution you. Okay, I must caution you. If you don't cooperate with this uh, saliva test, I rinse you liable to further arrest and prosecution for failing to cooperate with the roadside test. Okay. Fine, fine. Lovely. Whatever. Right, so how it works? You're gonna. Because you're struggling to find something on me at the moment, aren't you? Oh, oh I'm, 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 I'm having, I'm up having up the worst, the hardest speed. time ever, mate. Thought so. Yeah. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna do uh, a saliva test. So swab your tongue around the inside of your mouth for me. I'm gonna swab this over your tongue, okay? But you fucking enjoy me putting my tongue in my cheek like that. No, it's not really something I uh, I enjoy. To be frank with you. Prefer to keep my hands out of people's mouths. Right, so you test the uh, test of positive for cannabis. So you're currently under arrest. Uh, further. Oh, for a section 5A road traffic act offence, namely driving was under the influence of a controlled drug. You know how to say anything about an offence, you do make sure my question so it's later line in court and then you do say maybe given evidence, okay? So if you're in the car, Chantal. Um, yeah. All the tires gone. Yep. I was hiding, I was hiding behind the pillar when I put my car in the car park. Oh, what pillars for the hospital? Or pillar for the, no, uh, the by the bridge. motorway, by the bridge, and then it, I think it saw me at the very last <laughs> oh, moment. Then, oh, it's too late. Uh, I just pulled over into here, and he just uh, let it, she just let it roll into the uh, into the pillar. I don't think she Brilliant. would have stopped otherwise. Yeah, definitely don't think she would have stopped otherwise. Right, if you uh, if you're all right, then I'm gonna um, I'm gonna put her into the. Uh, into custody. We're going to do a further blood test. Yep, yeah, I'll just call for recovery on there. Lovely. Uh, miss him. User left your channel. All right then, Chantel. Wait, we're going because I need to tell my solicitor. You're not going to tell your solicitor because you're under arrest. You can tell your solicitor when we get to the station, all right? Well, no, because you need to tell him that I'm going custody. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. I know my rights. You can get a phone call for the solicitor and free and impartial legal advice if you get to custody, alright? But actually, first we're going to do a blood test so you can't get it before the blood test. Mate, you're fucking corrupt, you are. Not corrupt at all. Well, I'm going to have my solicitor straight away. In fact, frankly, I think you wouldn't have stopped for me if I hadn't done stopped you in the way I have. Well, you're entitled to your opinion, mm. police officer. Assuming I'm a criminal before I'm even one. I'm not assuming you're a criminal. But you just said I wouldn't stop. Where oh, are yeah. you that from? You don't even know me. Well, I, <laughs> I know you now, don't I? Seem to be uh, up to no good today, to be perfectly honest with you. I was just doing what I was told. What was he told? Go and take the car down the, f down the road. Down the road? Yeah. So it's not your car, I haven't got insurance on it. It's a stolen vehicle. Have you got... It's stolen? Yeah, I've, I've told you. That's <laughs> what That's what you're under arrest for. Unless you uh, can tell me, can who, you, me who you got it from. Who do you get it from? Well, I ain't a grass, I ain't telling you shit. Oh, okay, fair enough. Because if I drop my other half... The other half. I oh, rather right, explains it then. No, it? I didn't say it. No, it's not what I meant. It's not what you meant. <laughs> what do you mean then? <laughs> You're the part of your buddy. Fuck's sake! <laughs> right. So who's your who's your husband then? I am married to him. You're not married to him. Who's your fiance then? I'm not engaged to him. You're not engaged to him. <laughs> who, who is it then? Well, I'm telling you nothing. You tell me nothing. No worries then. Tell Jane and Grass. I'm sure you're not. You just you just go to prison for them. Yeah, but I ain't stupid. I know that if I'm in the car, I'm the one that gets in trouble. Right. Right, Chantel. Have a step out for me. I'd like to start walking into custody, please. Were you driving that vehicle in these high heels? Yeah. Okay, we'll process you fair for that then. Because I don't think you were in proper control of the vehicle because you were swerving quite a bit when uh, you approached me. 
Mark, drive perfectly in these just because you haven't done it. You haven't done what? Driving in hills, but you haven't done it, have you? No, I haven't. How can you say I'm not in proper control? You weren't even there. You were swerving out the lane. At first, I thought to you were doing you? it to avoid me, because you clearly weren't, because you couldn't see me. Right, Chantel. Chantel, have a seat. Have a seat on the chair. Right. What we're going to be doing, we're going to get a medical practitioner down here to take some blood for you. Okay. You're going to be doing that because you've been arrested for a Section 5A offence at the Road Traffic Act because you... Bloody, bloody, blah, yeah. Well, we've got some drugs in your body, okay. You're going to be taking that blood from you to analyse to see if you've got any drugs or alcohol in your system. Failing to provide this sample of blood for analysis will render you liable for arrest and prosecution. Do you agree to provide more specimen of blood for analysis? Yeah, I suppose. Okay, lovely. Brilliant. We'll get the practitioner down here now. Let's confirm your address, Chantel. Uh, I don't really have one, but I suppose... You get have um, one. It's not my ass, but I'm staying there. Is that alright? Okay. Uh, I don't think that's going to be alright then, actually. Well, what do you mean to fucking say about it? It's my fault. Left the motor vehicle, no insurance. Right, uh, we'll deal with that later. We're just going to get the blood from you now. Right, okay. What's going to happen is you're going to be um, charged to court with these offences. Um, we're going to be analysing your blood. And then uh, based on the result of that, we're going to be... Um, Either charging you with drug driving, or uh, well, obviously if you haven't got any drugs in your system, we won't be. At this point, I'm going to report you for the question to be considered prosecuting you for the offences of driving without due care and attention, left to a motor vehicle, driving without insurance, and driving whilst under the influence of a, uh, a drug. You don't have to say anything about it if it's. We do not mention now, so you should in court. Anything you do say may be given evidence. Do you have anything to say to that? It's fucking bollocks. That's what it is. Okay. You just like making it up as you go along. It's disgusting. Uh, because you haven't got an address, you're going to be uh, remanded in custody until you uh, until such time that you're going to be placed in front of a court. Okay. Whatever. Lovely. Here's your cell. If Can you I need... get my sister now? Yeah. You are entitled to free and impartially good advice. Would you like a copy of the code of practice for custody? No, but I want a different cell. Look at the fucking shit out of the wall there. That's disgusting. Would Give me another sale. Would you like free and impartial legal advice through a police yes. solicitor? Would you like a yes. through your own solicitor or through, your, through the police solicitor? I've got my own solicitor. Okay. Would you like a phone call? Yes. Okay. We'll arrange those for you. Okay. There'll be someone down for you momentarily to do that. If you need anything, there's a button there. We'll get you a glass of water and some bread. All right. Oh, whatever. Lovely. Bye-bye.